It's alive. Yes, this is a real insect, ladies and gentlemen. Believe it or not. Oh my God. What is this? Ladies and gentlemen, this is Bart Coppens, your favorite online bug expert. And today I have a bizarre species of lanternfly to introduce to you. Meet Fulgora laternaria. Let me tell you more about it. Oh, so what the heck is this thing then? This is the crocodile-headed bug, also known as the peanut bug. The peanut-headed lanternfly, the alligator bug, or something called... Jekutiranme <coughs> boa? What? I have no idea how to pronounce that. And many other names. They belong to the Fulgoridae, or the lanternfly family. The structure on its face is actually supposed to mimic a small tree dwelling with species of lizard rather than a crocodile, of course, but the resemblance is there with some imagination. As intimidating as this creature looks, it's completely harmless, like most other insects. It's very much a vegetarian that just sucks tree sap using his long proboscis that it can use to pierce plants. It will generally remain camouflaged on a tree trunk during the day, and it will knock its head on a hollow tree to create vibrations for mates. This species inhabits tropical rainforests in Mexico, Central America and South America. When they feel threatened, they can open their wings and to reveal two large intimidating eye spots. This scares their enemies into thinking they are facing a larger predator. It also attracts influencers that like insects. Huh? Huh? That's crazy, isn't it? Well, while it's not supposed to represent a crocodile, they say the snout is supposed to represent a small species of arboreal lizard, which perhaps makes some predators leave it alone. Ooh. 